these are dangerous, seriously dangerous, vicious hoodlums that need to be apprehended. Sheriff Howard Seals speaks about inmates Donnie Rowe and Ricky DuBose as the manhunt enters day three. The public is in grave danger. Seals says after ransacking a home in Madison, the escapees walked nine miles and sold this truck. FBI Special Agent David Lee Valley says he believes the two are still together but could be anywhere in the U.S. Whether that's here in the state of Georgia uh, or if they've left, uh, it has become a nationwide search. With more than 100 tips coming in from as far as Virginia and Texas, the GBI, the FBI, and U.S. Marshals are asking for help across America. We need the eyes and ears of everybody really in this country. To turn these two alleged killers into police and bring justice for Sergeant Curtis Ballou and Sergeant Christopher Monica. And the pain and anguish that was in the toes of my feet went up to my heart. These men were impactful to their communities, their families, and this agency. We will miss them deeply, and we cannot replace them. Putnam Sheriff Howard Seals believes it's not a matter of if they will catch the escapees, it's when. You need to surrender. You will be apprehended. In Morgan County, Yvonne Thomas, 13 WMAZ Eyewitness News. Again, if you know anything about the whereabouts of Donnie Rowe and Ricky DuBose, keep in mind that is a new picture released today of Donnie Rowe. You are asked to call the U.S. Marshals Service at 877-WANTED-2. Again, that's 877, the word wanted and the number 2. Investigators want to keep your eyes out for this truck. It's a white Ford F-250 pickup truck with tag number BCX-5372. Sheriff Sills says it's an older truck with damage to the right rear panel.